orange paint, debris, a teddy bear left on the road. The impact was like a, a building blowing up or something. It was terrible. The aftermath of a fatal collision. It was very horrific. It was really bad. Leaving a seven-year-old boy dead. It's very devastating. It gives you the chills when you see stuff like this. A surveillance video from a nearby business shows what some witnesses heard and saw. Just after 8.30 Thursday morning, Port Arthur police say a woman driving a pickup truck on 4th Avenue lost control, went through a parking lot, off a curb, and into Gulfway Drive. Her pickup hit a car traveling east. The truck overturned. The impact ejected the child from the vehicle. There go the little boy, flew out the car. It ended up falling on the little boy. The truck ended up on the little boy. People nearby rushed to help. I got a couple of my homeboys. We went over there to try to push it. And my customer and my worker tried to lift up the truck to get the kid out. But you know, everybody cried at that time. It's bad. The child died from his injuries. We have not seen any type of sign that the child was belted in, uh, and we have not found uh, any type of child restraint device inside the vehicle as of yet. The driver of the pickup was flown by medical helicopter to a hospital. Police believe she's the young boy's mother. It's scary. It's really scary. It's sad, too, because that's how fast things happen sometimes, you know. A collision that unfolded in a matter of seconds and claimed the life of a child. I think everything's going to be perfect, but you never know what's going to happen. In Port Arthur, Haley Bull, Fox 4 News.